Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living in retirement with having. What I have discovered throughout a community of gossiping girls and gossiping boys who are of age of majority is that they harm a life when they gossip in their little retail networks. Things that I have purchased have gone missing from my bags, missing from my pockets, missing from my things almost every day. What that means is that some retail employee is expressing to someone in their community, whoever they might be, that I have purchased something and they've told them what it is. Because that item is the item that goes missing from my life that I purchased fair and square with my own earnings. Every human being in America has the right to make a living. That is what we say in our Constitution, provided that you are a legitimate citizen. Something I noticed on campus is that there is a Chinese-oriented grub hub that is actually run by Chinese people. My question is, are those children actually legitimate citizens that allows them the work authorization from our government to do this? We have a lot of people who feel that they are above the law, is what people might say. But being above the law has to relate to the actual law, not the opinion of one person or opinion of the day. You see, the laws of America says that person owns their own body, their own property, their own paperwork. But we have families of origin and families of choice and total strangers in municipalities that lie, steal, and cheat people out of their life goods, their relationships that God places in front of them to do good, and literally their paperwork that governs their lives. When communities and when groups do this, it is actually called a term. That term is called mobbing. Famous people, educated people, brilliant people like Tesla suffered through mobbing. Mobbing is a group of people that are actually stalking someone. Do we not understand that stalking today is not only immoral in God's house, it is incredibly illegal today. So when children's people, meaning students of a college or high school, start harassing someone, that is a problem and it's called bullying. When community-run people or people paid to do a job in a community start using company equipment that is supported by the United States government under DOT laws, DOT laws, start using their vehicles on the job to stalk and harass someone, that's something else entirely. That is a risk to the organization a risk to the community and a risk to the person violating the responsibilities and accountabilities of their job.